Step one, wake up early, gonna rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. If you were wondering why Quidditch wasn't included in the Hogwarts legacy, Warner Bros. Discovery has provided an explanation. For many years, Unbroken Studios has been developing a quick-paced, intense multiplayer game based on the well-known sporting event from the Wizarding World. However, despite the fact that Harry Potter Quidditch Champions follows the success of Hogwarts Legacy, the game is billed as a complete standalone Quidditch experience in which players compete against one another in multiplayer games while having fun on broomsticks. Earlier this year, Hogwarts Legacy exceeded business estimates after selling more than 12 million copies in just two weeks. The Wizarding World will once again be the focus of Warner Bros. Discovery, but the open world Harry Potter role playing game was just the beginning. In addition to bringing Hogwarts Legacy to the PS4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch, Harry Potter Quidditch Champions will have J.K. Rowling serve as executive producer on a fresh live-action redemption of the acclaimed book series for Max. By allowing players to create the characters, Quidditch Champions will borrow a page from Hogwarts Legacy. Although a release date for Quidditch Champions is not yet set, players can already sign up for playtests. It will be interesting to see if Quidditch Champions experience the same problems that beset Hogwarts Legacy, especially in the weeks leading up to its release date, now that J.K. Rollins is firmly back in the spotlight. Drop your comments. Until the next one, boss out. Yeah, so I'ma fake it till I make it Positive thoughts are overtaken I got patience One day at a time is how you operate a cadence A flow, you grow, you show yourself a foundation Stay away from all the shit that causes temptation I know that I like to do it cause it's sensation I live my life